Yo guys, today it's time to see the best future wonder kids. These are me the players that could be the best players in football in the future. In goal for the team, we've got to go with the future stud of a player. It's got to be Donald Room. And this guy is just 17 years old, already plays at AC Milan. He's got an 84 in form on FIFA. And overall, he's going to be a fantastic keeper. I think this guy could be top three in the world in the future in terms of a goalkeeper position. I generally think... He's got everything. He's like six foot six, six foot seven. He's amazing. He's got a huge wingspan. And people already think he is literally the next in line for Buffon. He is that guy who could be in goal for Italy for the next two decades. Moving on, we're going to go to now, I think, Ajax. Um, surprisingly, going to go with this guy called Sanchez. For me, I've seen this guy play in real life as well for Ajax. And he was amazing. Got everything you could think of for a future centre-back. He's got good pace, got great physicality. And on the ball, he's a very good... Um, pass out of the ball as well. Very high completion rate in the Dutch league and I do think he'll probably get sold soon to a bigger club. He's been actually rumoured to be going to Bayern Munich or maybe even Dortmund um, so he's in there. Now we're going to go to a player who's on loan from I want to say Chelsea um, it is Christensen Andreas Christensen here um, who's a very very gifted player. I'm surprised he's alone. Honestly, I think he's going to start for Chelsea soon. He's a very good player and for me is already a good player and will be a great future player in the future for probably Chelsea. Now, we're going to go to another player at centre-back who has got to be in this team and to be honest, there's a lot of choices. You could have gone with Tar from uh, Leverkusen, could have gone with Yedvai, um, but I will be going with um, the Atletico Madrid player here by the name of Jimenez. A very, very um, promising player and I do think he will be a very good and great future um, player. Could be a lot like Godin being from Uruguay playing for Let's Go as well and is already a very good player but will be even better looking down the line. At centre mid guys I've got to go with Renato Sanchez who I think I packed in a two player pack. Yeah I think I did yeah. Um, and I've used him a lot in this game, not that card, but I've used him in draft and he's just amazing. But obviously in real life, he's got everything you can think of. He's got a great engine, very good vision, and I do think he'll be a great future player for sure. Like, I think we all know that he had to be. To be honest, he was the first name on this team sheet, like he had to be. Now, centre mid, gonna go to La Liga again um, for a guy who was actually on loan at Espanyol. And he was so good that people think he's going to be better than Isco, better than James Rodriguez. They may even sell them because of this guy. He's that great already. And Zidane has already shown so much faith, which tells you how gifted this guy is. It's not Casemiro. It's going to be Asen Sal. This guy is a very, very um, talented player now, but will obviously be a much better player looking forward. People think he'll be world class. Let me know if you agree with that statement. Now, going to go to Cam. Um, this one was a tough one as there's a lot of cams you could have gone with um, but for me I wanted to pick this guy by the name of Delhi Ali 80 raids on FIFA but I think I think already he's proven himself to be a very very good and gifted player but I do think he'll be even better looking in the future like he's going to be a great English um, international player I do think he'll be one of our most like important players could even be a future captain not sure but could be anyway now we're going to go back to the Bundesliga by the way there are obviously a few players missing from this. This for me is mostly my opinion. There's one player which I left for you guys to vote in, which I think would be pretty exciting um, in the striker position. Anyway, right mid though. Gotta go with my man Usman Dembele. Where is he? I think he's there. There you go. Uh, yeah, I mean, there's so many great Dembele players. You've got Usman from Dortmund. You've got Musa from Celtic and Spurs. And yeah, there's a lot of exciting talent around by the name of Dembele. This guy's one of them, is already um, proving himself to be worth the transfer to Dortmund, and he is gonna be a very good player. He already is, but he's gonna get even better as his uh, career goes on. Now, a left mid, I'm actually gonna use a guy who could play left mid. Um, it's actually gonna be another Dortmund player by the na name of Emre Moore. Obviously, he's got a screen card there. He's already proving to be a very nice addition to their team. He's a, he's a, he's a kind of player who can like make something happen out of nothing, can get into really tight spaces and angles and make things work and really make things tick for Dortmund. He could be a really important player for them, you know, looking down in like, what, two or three years, maybe even sooner, maybe even now. He's already played a lot for, for uh, Dortmund. Now, striker, we're going to go back to the Premier League. You guys may guess who this one is. Um, this guy is a, like he in terms of the phrase wonder kid. This is a wonder kid This guy is literally the biggest wonder kid probably in the planet right now. It's still Marcus Rashford. He has the talent He has everything you could want from a young player and he already is a great player But I think he's gonna gone to be even maybe world-class. I'm willing to say that as a massive 
Liverpool fan. I'm actually saying that. I think he will be world class in the future for sure. Um, and yeah, there is like my opinion, guys, of the best future Wonder Kids players who will be amazing for their clubs and country. Now to the final player in the team, and it's a very special one. This is the player that you guys wanted me to include in the best Wonder Kids edition of this video. And yeah, it's going to be Karamoko. Dembele, this kid, and I say kid, he's 13 years old and already he's being scouted by Barcelona, Dortmund, uh, Liverpool, or we are, um, you know, Man City doing it, United are, and every big club in the world you can think of is after this kid. He's 13 years old, guys, and already he's tearing things up. Every game he's playing in, he looks incredible. So I hope that he does have an amazing career. I had to include him in this Wonder Kids video. You guys wanted so bad. And will he get a FIFA card? He's already played for the under 16 or under 17, um, I think Scottish national team against Wales, I think. Um, and he played amazing. So maybe he could be in FIFA sooner than we think. I'm not sure if that's even allowed. Um, but yeah, what do you guys think about Karamoko Dembele? Will he be a great player in the future? Interestingly, with Dembele, England have actually um, invited him to train with the under 17 national team. So already he is that good so I think the, the future is very bright for Dembele and I hope he does represent England just being a bit selfish there he could also represent Scotland and Ivory Coast but still it'll be amazing to see Dembele um, get a card that would be that would be unseen on FIFA we've never had anything like that um, yeah what do you guys think about these wonder kids let me know in the comments below which cards do you think well, sorry which players do you think will be the best players in the future let me know um, but yeah Dembele especially they'll all be great